Whether you're starting to plan a spring break trip or looking for just a warm getaway to escape this cold weather, it can be a tough decision to decide where exactly to go. I'm sure South is on that list, but to help us out this morning, the Valley Today's Abby Furchner joins us live with a travel agent. Good morning, Abby. Well, good morning, guys. Whether it's spring break or you're just looking to escape this cold weather for a while, you're probably starting to plan that 2019 trip. And I'm here with Sandy Anders with Burst Travel. And what are some of the hottest destinations we're seeing for 2019 where people are wanting to go to? Winter of this year, a lot of people are going to the Dominican Republic. Um, it's Caribbean, it's affordable, and it's absolutely beautiful. Um, Mexico is, is still popular. Um, uh, Jamaica is one of my favorite places, and um, but the Dominican seems to be the hot spot. Absolutely, and you were telling me that you've been to Costa Rica quite a few times. Is that still at the top of the list for 2019? I have planned quite a few Costa Rica trips. Um, it depends on what you want out of Costa Rica. There's the jungle area and there's the beach area, and um, it's absolutely amazing. And so why are these destinations so popular? What can you do there? It's so different. Um, you can zip line through the jungle in Costa Rica. You can sit in sprinkling rain in a hot spring and just just enjoy life. Travel really improves your health because you're meeting new people. You're you're expanding your horizons globally. I mean, things that we don't really consider we're doing, it really does help. And it, it, they're just, vacation is always just so much fun because like you said, you get to experience new things and it's not just so much the weather, but all the fun activities you get to plan and you get to do. And so in just a few minutes, we'll be talking a little bit more about those health benefits of traveling, especially when you live in a climate like North Dakota. All right, good stuff. We'll check in with you again soon. Thank you, Abby. Still ahead on the